Hey y'all, so I wanted to do a very uh, short video about uh, maintenance of the steak locker. I had mine off for a few months. I've been trying to lose some weight. Um, so I cleaned it, um, got it, got it ready to start using it again. So I wanted to give you kind of uh, a few ideas of what I did to clean it and then what I learned about uh, that process. So I started by removing everything I could from the refrigerator and gently washing it with these soap, um, including the tracks uh, there, as you can see. That, that hold the racks and um, I removed the, the bar at the top. I'm no longer going to use it, it's just in the way. So um, I, I just removed that. Um, one note on uh, unscrewing things inside, it made it easier to clean, but putting them back in, um, it they don't hold as hard as um, before. So my advice is just don't unscrew those things, just wash everything inside. I ordered a new yellow filter from uh, Steak Locker. They, they shipped it, it was easy. And then I also um, replaced the activated charcoal in the air filter. So now in the video, you can see it's it's back up and running. I set it up with the uh, salt blocks again, um, and I put a little bit of uh, protection <laughs> from drippings. So we'll see how that goes. I also put my own temperature and humidity sensor that's connected to my home automation. If you're interested in that, let me know. I'll create a video. Otherwise, I'm back up and running. I'm going to go with higher humidity this time, and I'm going to do probably um, 60 days. And uh, I'll let you know in the next video how it goes.